Hi everyone, my name is Alex. Today I'm going to be trying the Bubble Overnight Hydrating Sleep Mask. This product retails for $20. This product is actually an exclusive that was launched whenever Bubble launched with Ulta. I was just scrolling through skincare on Ulta's website and I stumbled upon this product and I realized that this product hasn't been released on any other platform. Even before Bubble announced that they were releasing an exclusive product, I saw this product and I went ahead and ordered it because I really wanted to try another product from Bubble. I love this skincare brand. They're very affordable. They are very easily accessible. I really have loved so many of their products that I've tried on this channel. This product is vegan, cruelty-free, fragrance-free, alcohol-free, and comes in recyclable packaging. This product is loaded with so many great ingredients. Some of those include maple sap, mandelic and kojic acid, and sodium PCA. To check out the full ingredient list, make sure you click the link in the description to go to the website. This product does say that it is designed for all skin types from sensitive to acne prone skin. I'm very interested to see if this product does cause acne. That's one of the big things I always look for with hydrating products. I'm hopeful that this product will be suitable for all skin types. I do have combination acne prone skin, so I will just be putting that to the test and see how it performs. I really also just want to see how much hydration it delivers to the skin. I feel like that is a very important element of a hydrating mask. It did say that you apply this product onto wet skin, which is a little bit different for a hydrating mask for me. I don't know why. A lot of times leave-on hydrating mask I just apply as the last step in my skincare routine when my skin is dry. As for anything else, I will be continuing to do check-in. So I will see you all in the next check-in. Hi everyone, I'm here to give you all a quick check-in on this product. So I've been using this product for about a week now. I didn't have any breakouts on my face until of course I ruined it by wearing makeup and dressing up for Halloween, but like I couldn't help that. Like I was definitely gonna do that. But yeah, this product is one of my favorite overnight sleeping masks that I've ever used. It is so hydrating and it is so nourishing for the skin. My skin absolutely loves this product. It just like soaks it in perfectly. They also recommended to apply this on wet skin. I tried that at first and it wasn't my favorite way of using this product. I really just enjoy using it after a moisturizer as like something to kind of seal in all of that hydration. I definitely feel like this product could stand alone by itself and maybe if you didn't go in with a moisturizer it would be better to apply this on the wet skin. I just prefer to use it right after a moisturizer. It's been working great for me. It's been delivering some great results and I wake up and my skin feels very hydrated which is great for this time of year because usually during the winter I struggle with it. When the weather starts getting colder my skin gets so dry. I'll wake up the next morning with the heat running and my skin will feel so dehydrated but this product really has been working to correct that. It has a very lightweight kind a cream consistency to it. It's almost like a gel cream, but I mean, it just adds so much hydration to the skin. I feel like any skin type could use it if you do need an extra layer of hydration to the skin. Like I said, it didn't break me out for the first week of using it. There are just a couple of zits right now on my skin and my hyperpigmentation is a little bit worse. That usually happens when I wear like skin tints or makeup or something. What I do is I just take like two pumps of this. It really does not take much and then I just rub it on the skin. In my opinion, I don't feel like you have to use it every night but it is good to have on hand for those days that you just feel extra dry. I'm not sure if you can tell, but it added so much hydration to my skin. It made my skin so dewy and it has a really nice finish to it. It's also not very suffocating. I really was worried that this product would make me feel extra greasy, which I mean, it is heavier than a typical moisturizer because it is a sleeping mask. But when I wake up, my skin feels great. It's not overly hydrated, but yet it's not dry. It has a great level of hydration to this skin. So yeah, I'm enjoying this product. I'm going to continue to use it and then I'll check in again. So I will see you all in the next check. Hi everyone. I'm back to give you all my final thoughts on this product. 
So I feel like that this is a great overnight sleeping mask. Like I said in the last check-in, my favorite way to use this product was after a lightweight moisturizer. I would go in with this product after that to kind of seal in all the moisture from my serums and that lightweight moisturizer. But I do feel like that this product is also good to use by itself, depending on what kind of skin type you have and also what you're looking for with this mask. This is definitely, in my opinion, going to be a holy grail for dry skin. This didn't cause any acne to come up on my skin and it's actually done really well to heal my skin and add a nice level of hydration to my skin to rebuild my moisture barrier. It's an amazing product for that and I just really enjoyed this product overall. If you are more oily to combination skin, I feel like this product is just something to keep on hand. It's not that expensive so I would recommend just having a bottle of this if your skin gets dehydrated. I really didn't feel like I needed to use it every night unless I just had been doing stuff or my skin felt really dry. There really wasn't any need to use it every night for me. I'm so glad that this product didn't cause any acne because this product is so hydrating and there's always such a stigma around hydrating products causing acne. This is one of my favorite sleeping masks if not my overall favorite one because, because it really did a great job to hydrate my skin without causing any acne to come up and that is rare for me with the product. I would 100% recommend trying it. Bubble just really did amazing with the formulation of it and taking into consideration all skin types when making this product. My skin can feel really dry at night. This product really helped to correct that and especially this area right here, I usually get red bumps because I get so dry and this product worked to correct that and make my skin overall very balanced. I would wake up and my skin wouldn't feel greasy. It would just feel very nourished and very hydrated. If you are looking for an overnight sleeping mask that is very nourishing and I mean I didn't experience acne so I do feel like it is acne prone friendly, I really fell in love with this product so I would 100% recommend trying it. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and you want to see more like this, make sure you subscribe because I post new videos every week and I will see you all in the next review.